In this problem, we're asked to find how much tension must a rope withstand if it is used to accelerate a 1,210 kilogram car horizontally along a frictionless surface at 1.2 meters per second squared. So before we solve the problem, let's write down what we're given. So we're told uh, the mass of the car, and so mass is going to be equal to 1,210 kg. So we know kg is mass, so we know the mass of the car. And then we know it's uh, going at 1.2 meters per second squared. And so meters per second squared is um, the units for acceleration. So we know the acceleration is going to be 1.2 meters per second squared. And so they're asking how much tension. And so what you should know is that tension is a force. So I'm just going to denote it as F. So F, we're trying to find this force, uh, which is tension. So we don't know what it is yet. So we're just going to say F equals question mark for now. But let's go ahead and solve. So we know force is equal to mass times acceleration. And so you have to memorize this formula. And so if we're solving for force, all we have to do is plug in our mass and then plug in our acceleration. Uh, one thing to keep in mind though is that uh, force is measured in newtons and you need to make sure that your mass is measured in kg and your acceleration is in meters per second squared. So if they give it to you in something different, uh, you have to change it to those. So in this case, we're, uh, they're both in the correct units, so we don't have to worry. But if they're not, make sure to change them. So all we have to do is plug in. So mass is 1,210 times our acceleration, which is 1.2. And so if you go ahead and do that, you're going to get F equals uh, 1,450. And we measure force in newtons. So it's going to be 1,450N. So N just stands for newtons. Uh, but just keep in mind that N represents newtons. So the force is going to be 1,450 newtons. And so, yeah, that's going to be the answer to this problem.